WASP-17b is a planet orbiting a star similar to the Sun that's about 1300 light years away. WASP is an acronym of Wide Angle Search for Planets, which uses an array of robotic telescopes to survey the whole sky and monitor thousands of stars simultaneously, looking for slight changes in brightness caused by planets transiting or passing in front of their stars as seen from Earth. WASP-17b is one of the most unusual exoplanets that astronomers have come across to date. It orbits just 7 million kilometers from the surface of its star, 20 times closer than Earth is to the Sun, and completes an orbit every 3.7 days, so its year is a little over three and a half days long. Not surprisingly, it's very hot, with a surface temperature of about 1500 Celsius, hot enough to melt nickel or steel. It's also very large, with a diameter roughly twice that of Jupiter. In fact, it's a high temperature gas giant, or what's known as a hot Jupiter. Being hot is one of the reasons it's so big. Its mass, though, is only about half that of Jupiter, so it's also one of the least dense or puffiest planets we know. Its claim to fame doesn't end there, however. Thanks to NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, researchers have detected evidence for quartz nanocrystals in the high-altitude clouds of WASP-17b. This is the first time that silica or silicon dioxide particles have been spotted in an exoplanet atmosphere. The quartz crystals are only about 10 nanometers across, so small that 10,000 of them would fit side by side across a human hair. Webb observed the WASP-17 system for nearly 10 hours as the planet passed in front of its star, collecting more than 1,200 brightness measurements in mid-infrared light, with wavelengths from 5 to 12 microns. Researchers then subtracted the brightness of individual wavelengths of light that reached the telescope when the planet was in front of the star from those of the star on its own. That way they were able to figure out how much of each wavelength was blocked by the planet's atmosphere. What emerged was an unexpected bump at 8.6 microns that was best explained by clouds composed of quartz, rather than magnesium silicates or other possible high temperature aerosols like aluminium oxide. The results suggest a new way that exoplanet clouds can form and evolve. Rather than magnesium-rich silicates like olivine and pyroxene seen on other exoplanets, the researchers found the building blocks to be pure silica. Exactly how much quartz there is and how pervasive the clouds is tough to determine, but researchers aim to do just that by combining these observations of WASP-17b with other observations of the system by the Webb Space Telescope.